guys and welcome back to the rocking with more future channel today we're going to be doing the first video video <clears throat> sorry in my easy metal guitar riff series targeting beginners who are looking to get into the 80s metal sound guitar style <laughs> and i think this will be an easy way for you guys to catch on and understand what that sound was and how to play that type of music by, you know, learning easy, easy riffs. This particular one will be based on Cinderella's uh, popular song from the 80s called Sip, Somebody Save Me. Okay? Uh, but before we get started, if you haven't already, give this video a thumbs up, like the video, subscribe to the channel, and hit the notification button so you can get updates whenever I put out a new video. All right? Now, the tabs for this lesson will be available for free on my Buy Me Coffee page. It would be appreciated, wink wink, if you can uh, donate some money to help support the channel. There will also be a link with a discount code to my new bar chord video course called Mastering Bar Chords. Alright, so there will be a link, a separate link um, to that particular course. Alright guys, so let's get started. Alright, so, the chords in this video, the first one's an A, then an F power chord, but not the typical F bar, F bar chord, uh, uh, F power chords you think of on the, uh, the first and third fret. What you're going to do is you're going to think of a C power chord and move it down one string. So you're going to have your first finger on the uh, Then, the last chord you're going to do is you're going to put your finger, whether it's two fingers or one finger, sometimes I do one with my index finger, but you can do like your second or third finger like that if you want to, would be on the seventh fret on the D and the G string, okay? And in between the chords, you're going to give the open A string palm mutes twice okay and each chord gets hit I think about twice so let's check it out chord on the seventh fret you're gonna do some slides now the first slide is going to be on the fifth fret both the D and the G string and you're just gonna slide up just like that okay then you're gonna go to the seventh fret the same notes that you played in that chord on the D chord both the D and the A string and slide that up and then you're gonna slide go back to the fifth fret, D, G string, and slide that up. So if we go, get, okay, and then you put it all together. guys that's it for today's lesson again tabs will be available for free on my buy me coffee page and uh, again there will be a link for my new bar chord instructional course uh, feel free to help the sports channel by either buying a course or um, buy me give me a tip on my buy me coffee page and obviously the biggest thing you can do is not only subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and give it a thumbs up and hit the notification bell, but if you could share the video to your friends. All right, guys, till next time. This is Mark signing out. Keep on rocking. Are you frustrated because you can't seem to play bar chords? Do you avoid songs that have bar chords in them? Well, then, my Mastering Bar Chords course is the one for you. 
I will show you the techniques, the drills, riffs needed in order to master and conquer bar chords once and for all. Get my bar chord course today.